So the bigger challenge for us is uh, how do you retain people? Because many a times the freshers when they come in, uh, within six months, one year after you train, they leave. So that has been a big challenge which we are still trying to address. Uh, we were uh, thinking of looking at some kind of a retainership, at least three years. Want to so, work? Huh? Want to work? I don't know. So I, I'm, 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 I'm just, saving you time. Yeah. Okay. Fine. <laughs> so that's why I was just trying to figure out how do we uh, do this. So I want you to understand this. The world of business has seen three generations: the industrial revolution, the information revolution, and now we are in this revolution called the social revolution. Industrial revolution. People took a job for survival. They wanted basic necessity of roti, kapda, makan. So they went in and they worked in a workplace and they didn't leave that workplace even if the boss was abusive and even if the boss would physically beat them up, people would not leave. That was the era of bosses always right yeah. because opportunities were less. Yeah. That is pretty pretty much the grandparents of today's workforce. Then came the information revolution where all these IT companies brands started building. And the workforce then came to work not for survival because their parents took care of survival. This workforce went to work for standard of living, basically get a good enough salary to pay the house EMI, the car EMI, children's education loan. Pretty much your generation, you went to work for that for standard yeah, of living. Absolutely, yeah. Now in this generation, loyalty reduced. Now the truth is, then loyalty never existed in the first place. Loyalty didn't correct. exist. There was no option. This generation, information revolution, got option. If they got a better quality of workplace and they got a better uh, pay, then people would jump a job, right? Now this was the information revolution. Then came the third revolution. After 2008's recession, information revolution died. Today, information is available for free. You can learn coding on YouTube. You don't have to. Ha it's no longer a hidden knowledge. So, you need to understand. Now we live in a digital revolution or a social revolution where everything is social, which means today's workforce. They don't care about survival. Their grandparents took care of that. They don't care about standard of living. Their parents took care of that. Even the labor does not care about standard of living anymore because even labor has Dish TV and Tata Sky in their house. So if you'll say I'll cut your pay or if you'll say I'll bind you with a contract, they will say thank you so much. I'm finding another job. Today's workforce needs something else. They want quality of life, not standard of life. Standard of life, parents took care. Today's workforce is thinking quality of life, which means quality of workplace, which means quality of job, quality of environment, quality of role, opportunity, learning and rewards, all of that. Unless you don't have a mechanism for that, you will always grapple with this retention.